right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a scarce and um, fascinating um, autobiography by the great uh, Victorian architect Sir George Gilbert Scott, written in, and published in 1879, Personal and Professional Recollections, um, and it's a scarce book. I'll get on to that in a moment. And, and what I'm doing this month is selling a number of sort of what are called reading copies, i.e. copies of books which are in pretty... Um, uh, distressed condition. This has been uh, from Hampstead Subscription Library. The spine is battered. The book itself falls, I'm afraid, into various um, uh, sections there. Um, as you can see, uh, the signatures of the book have come loose. So it's almost a bundle of pages in part of it. But I think the text of the book is complete. So it's a complete autobiography of the great Victorian architect, full of wonderful um, stories and anecdotes and professional um, um, opinions and rather robust opinions on some of his clients um, but it's in this distressed condition so for reading, reference, scholarship it's very very useful um, currently on the uh, antiquarian book uh, site Abe Books. Um, I found just four copies of this book. They're priced at £63, £80, and two, I think, at £81. Now, because my copy's in this condition, uh, I'm selling it much cheaper than that. So you can acquire the text of a scarce Victorian architectural autobiography, an unusual uh, uh, subject, um, for much less than the going price for uh, possibly more... Um, um, uh, sound books. There we are. Gilbert Scott, Autobiography, 1879. Thank you very much indeed. Bye.